My name is Brooks Pearson, and today, along with my team members, Sarah Fife, Carly Field, Mir Vergi, and Peter Hogan, we're excited to introduce our innovative concept for artificial intelligence in Aldi, grocery carts with built-in scanners. Artificial intelligence, or AI, is becoming more relevant in today's society and in the business world. Aldi being one of the first to implement this cart into their stores would give them a significant way to differentiate themselves from competitors and attract those drawn to a more modern, convenient shopping experience. This can ultimately help Aldi stay ahead of the competitors in a rapidly evolving retail landscape. The big goal of the grocery cart with built-in scanners for Aldi is easy personalization and inventory management. Rick Alelda, a writer for Oracle, wrote on August 29, 2023, that the key takeaways of effective inventory management are that it helps grocery realtors reduce the need to discard or discount products, improves customer satisfaction and retention by ensuring that products are available when people want them, and aggregates selling data lets retailers fine-tune their inventory to account for days of the week when a given product are especially high in demand. Currently, the issue at hand we are hoping these grocery, helping these grocery carts with built-in scanners will solve is making inventory management more aligned with these takeaways that make an effective and seamless customer experience with a faster checkout and effective store navigation and personalized suggestions for customers. Now that I've told you about the current issue on hand and how these grocery stores intend to help, I next wanna tell you about how these grocery carts align with all these values. Not only would these grocery carts with built-in scanners start solve a large issue faced in the grocery industry, but they also fit all these values of consistency, simplicity, and responsibility. The simplicity of the grocery cart will increase customer satisfaction in the way checkout is quicker, customers can easily search on the cart where items are located in the store, and if an item is in the store, the customers can expect a consistent personalized recommendation and promotions. Aldi would get constant data back from these grocery carts on what items in the store the customers are finding most desirable and how much time customers are spending in the store. Aldi even gets to take the responsibility of AI assistance to ensure that financial records and inventory of the store are utmost accuracy. Overall, I told you about the current issues at hand and how the implementation of these grocery carts intend to help. I want to pass the presentation to Sarah Fife, who will tell you about the cost benefit analysis of Aldi and how AI is currently being implemented in the stores. Thank you, Brooks. To start, I want to look at this statistic report that was published on March 14th of 2022. This report summarizes that Aldi is projected to have revenue growth, but a declining growth rate. And it neglects to look at the enhanced and personalized shopping experience that this cart can give. The data the cart can give, the efficiency of checkout from these carts, and the effective reports that the cart can provide for Aldi. These benefits, along with the overall competitive advantage Aldi would receive, easily defies this report. Many grocery stores currently are looking for more personalized mobile approach. This mobile approach can include implementing AI into the sense of a phone application where items are scanned as you shop and then you check out and leave with a digital receipt. Or this could be making a grocery list and having someone shop for you and you just go and pick up the groceries. If Aldi were to implement grocery carts with built-in scanners, it would be a uniform experience throughout the store, something that both the scan and go apps and the purchase and pickup apps are missing. Aldi would ensure a consistent and efficient shopping experience for all. This uniformity not only enhances convenience, but also reinforces customer satisfaction, setting Aldi apart in the competitive landscape of grocery retail. Now that I've discussed the cost-benefit analysis of AI and Aldi, the current implementations of AI in stores, Peter will now talk about how AI can benefit supermarkets and the success of Aldi being in its low prices. AI technologies integrated into modern stores offer numerous benefits, including enhanced customer satisfaction, optimized supply chain operations, cost reduction, improved financial and inventory management, and decreased instances of shoplifting. These advantages enable employees to focus on enhancing customer interactions and service standards. Furthermore, with a projected $26 billion investment in AI services within the next few, five years, there's potential for even greater advancements, solidifying AI's role in retail evolution. All these stand to gain a significant competitive advantage by being an early adopter of these innovations, which could bolster their brand image and position them as market leaders. Aldi, renowned for its affordability, offers price private labeled brands of comparable quality to major brands at lower prices, prompting competitors to reduce prices. With high customer satisfaction and a vast selection of fresh produce, Aldi could invest in grocery carts with built-in scanners, leveraging its focus on food retailing. 
The practice of using quarter deposits for cards underscores their commitment to simplicity. Enhancing the shopping experience aligns with all these core values and could greatly impact the, its market position. Now that I've talked about how AI can benefit supermarkets, how successive Aldi and AI technology will be in its low prices, Carly will now talk about how our AI solution, how it works, and the shortcomings of the grocery card scanners. Thank you, Peter. Inspired by Kroger's Crow Go by Caper Incorporated, these cards would allow shoppers to scan items and pay directly with the cart. Not only do these cards function like the checkout line at the store, but they also allow customers personalized promotional offers and have navigation throughout the store so items can be found and grabbed quickly. By adapting and fine-tuning such innovations to suit the unique context of Aldi, we anticipate significant potential for transformative benefits. The strategic alignment has the potential to yield dramatic improvements in customer satisfaction and operational efficiency, positioning Aldi at the forefront of modern retail excellence. If Aldi could ultimately implement these into all stores quicker than Kroger, they would be remembered for it and have the potential to become a leader in the market. While these grocery carts seem amazing, they do face potential shortcomings that could fall under technical issues, like the cart not recognizing the products in the store, the cart not keeping security or keeping the customer's privacy safe and encrypted. There could also be a major pushback by customers who don't want to use the carts. The key thing that would make Aldi's implementation with the cart so successful is the way Aldi has always been close with its sponsors. If Aldi does take the existing technology Caper developed and partners with them, there is no doubt that Aldi will be persistent in reaching out to them with any issues the second they are seen. The close partnership should ultimately alleviate any concerns regarding technical issues. As for the issues regarding pushback from customers, Aldi should try to train and educate staff on the cart so they can help customers adapt to the cart and see firsthand the benefits these can provide to the shopping experience. Now that I've told you about how leveraging Aldi's AI technology is within its low prices, what the grocery cart with the built-in scanner is, how it works, and the potential shortcomings of the cart, Mir will conclude our presentation today by telling you how these grocery carts should be implemented and how they align with Aldi in the grand scheme. To implement the grocery carts at Aldi, we propose a three-stage rollout plan. First is pilot test and staff training where Aldi will conduct pilot testing and select stores to gauge customer reactions and identify potential issues. Staff will undergo training to assist customers with the cards and troubleshoot any problems. Next, the next stage is to enhance user friendliness and re reliability where Audi will focus on making the cards user friendly with clear instructions and ensure the technology is reliable. Future upgrades such as integrating a smaller ATM for cash payments will be considered to keep up with the evolving technology. Finally is promotional marketing and communication once successful, pilot testing is confirmed and cards are deployed in all stores. Audi will promote their benefits through various channels, including in-store signage, social media, and promotional offers to incentivize customer usage. This strategy aligns with Audi's goals of enhancing customer experience and integrating modern technology into its operations. These grocery cards align with Audi in four key ways. The first is enhanced customer experience. The, car, the cards offer personalized shopping tips and promotions, facilitating faster checkout, thereby boosting customer satisfaction and loyalty. Then is efficient operations. Advanced inventory management re reduces waste, waste and shortages, enabling Audi to maintain low prices and establish market leadership. Next is the industry impact. Implementing AI in, in the grocery industry demonstrate Audi's commitment to retail technology leadership. Finally, as a connection with Audi's values, consistency, simplicity, and responsibility are upheld through the efficient shopping experience provided by these cards. By focusing on these areas, the cards elevate customer satisfaction, reinforce loyalty, and position Audi as a retail leader. I now want to delve into the sources that have, been, that have informed and inspired our vision for Audi's future with AI-powered grocery cards. Thank you.